Hello, welcome to the tour of our house. We are currently up for sale and we are looking for somewhere slightly bigger, but currently this is our home, so enjoy. Welcome to our house! This is our front room and we don't normally use this room to sit in, but it's nice and comfortable, especially in the winter because it has the fireplace. And this then leads you through. This is the door to downstairs where the cellar is, but I'll show you that shortly. And this is our lounge. This is the one we use the most. Up there is my favourite thing, which is the mirror. Um, I got it off a of Facebook sale, so I um, really, really, really like the mirror. And it goes with anything, old or new. Um, so we really enjoy that. Through there you can see Erin's playroom, but I'll take that to that shortly. And here is the kitchen. My favourite thing in this kitchen. Hmm. Probably the granite chopping board and the spice rack. The two of my favourite things in here. Really, really like those actually. Through here we have the utility room. We have an extra fridge in here, which is great for alcohol and things. Those mummy needs. <laughs> Uh, here's our utility area with the washing machine and um, my favourite item in here is definitely the Belfast sink and this is our downstairs bathroom um, it's quite compact but does the job and it is Matthew's favourite room because it has his pictures of weeing dogs and his stag that's the only place they're allowed in this house. Coming up from the kitchen, we have the room every mom dreams of, the playroom. It's fab because I can see her in through here when she's in here. We do have a television in here with a DVD player just so she can watch her DVDs because she watches them on repeat. We have lots of castles and a thousand Disney princesses and her cooker and it also doubles up as our dining room. So it's a great space. Um, my favourite thing in here is possibly the castle. <laughs> I do enjoy playing with that because we also have a doll's house too. This here is my favourite piece in the entire house. This is the fern cotton chair from Very, and only fern cotton and I have this exact print because it did get changed but because Matthew's dad um, makes them then we were able to get this print, which is fab. And then this leads you on to our garden. As you can see, Erin is currently making some tomatoes and she's also growing some strawberries and blueberries there. And then we just have the slide and just somewhere to sit. Uh, this is our cellar. And it also doubles up as our guest bedroom. So it's got plenty of storage and a window seat television and if I bring you round it's also got a bed in here which has a pull out bed at the bottom so we can have it into a double so it's a nice little space just for guests and this takes you to our staircase we have at the top of the stairs the trusty stair gate because Erin's as clumsy as me and then we come to Erin's bedroom my favourite item in this bedroom is possibly the bunting. We love bunting, we've got it all over the walls. As you can see, and she has her personalised bunting here, and a fireplace of Minnie Mouse's. Erin's able to have the view of the green from her bedroom. And we've got these fantastic curtains that have got lining underneath, so she's got double the blackout because she's a early riser. Then you come to our bathroom. We have the shower and the sink and the toilet. And my favourite thing in here is this jar. We get all of our stones and shells from holiday and pop them in the jar when we're back. And then we come to my shoe cupboard. Who doesn't need a shoe cupboard? 
bit messy because Matthew has to put all of his shoes on the bottom. But I take over most of the shoe cupboard with my shoes. This is mine and Matthew's bedroom. We have the cheval mirror, which is instead of me having a dressing table, it saves me having to get makeup everywhere so I can pop it all in there. We've got the television, the window, the built in wardrobes, and the bed. My favourite item in here is this fantastic piece of machinery and if you turn it on, basically what you do is pop the time in and put your alarm on and when the alarm comes on it wakes you up like the sun. For people that get grumpy like me, this is a brilliant purchase, I've had this now for seven years and it's been great. Um, and when the sun comes up as bright as it can go, it then turns on the radio. So at the moment, we get it brighter, and then the radio comes on 